Let me tell you what, there's a lot to say about what I actually teach at UCR Extension Program because I teach a multitude of classes, but my focus is tax planning, government accounting, budgeting, managerial accounting, cost accounting, all about numbers. Um, I mean, I'm qualified to teach much more, but that's where I teach most of my classes at. Well, it's very interesting how I got interested in my field because way back in the day in 1972, I took an actually an accounting course and I really loved it. I loved numbers. They made sense to me. Um, so and I've always been really good with numbers. And I know you guys have seen TV shows where where people are mathematicians are really good with numbers. That's how I feel when I deal with numbers. So that's how I got started. The best advice I can give to someone who wants a career in some sort of accounting field is to make sure you like numbers. Most people either hate them or love them. There's nothing in between. And so what I would say is um, most people actually take my courses to sit for the CPA exam. But if you're going to do this, if you're going to take accounting courses, first of all, make sure you like numbers, then decide what aspect of accounting you really wanna work in. There is public and there is private, and there's big differences between the two. So really figure out what it is you really wanna do or what it is you really like to do. My favorite top few subjects to teach is number one, tax planning, number two, managerial accounting, and then cost accounting. And the reason I put tax planning up front is because people have such uh, a fear or such a um, different perspective of what taxes are really like than what they really are. And that's kind of a knowledge to teach people that, look, there is power here. You can figure out how to manage your taxes, what you owe, what you're going to go owe, and plan appropriately for it. So. And managerial and cost accounting, they just make sense from a business perspective. And I have a business background in manufacturing. And so they just make sense. They help you understand how to run your business. Well, the top three skills that the students should get from my courses they take is first, number one, they need to realize how important it is for a, you as a business owner or them as a business owner that they need to know the material. They don't have to have know it so well that they could do it uh, easily. They just need to understand how it affects their business and their bottom lines. And I'm talking about their profit and loss sheets and stuff like that. Um, and, and the second thing is they can always hire someone to do it. But even when you hire somebody to do your accounting, you still need to understand what it is you're looking at. So that's number two. And number three, I'm going to repeat myself again. They either love it or hate it. Nothing in between. And so you decide if you really hate it, don't take the courses. Don't take this field of action. Well, let me tell you about myself. Let me tell you two truths and a lie about me and not in that particular order, by the way. First of all, as you can see by the video, I'm not a Twiggy model. Uh, I used to weigh 100 pounds more than I do now. I used to speak French fluently when I was 13 years old and I love to water ski. As you can see, I'm very tan. Those are my two truths and a lie. Now, let me tell you the lie. The lie is I have never been able to get my rear end up out of the water on a water ski, okay? I have tried, but I have not been successful. But yes, I spoke French fluently when I was 13. I was raised in France, and I did used to weigh 100 pounds heavier and had weight loss surgery. Cat or dog? Definitely cat. I've always been a cat person. Netflix or YouTube? You know, I'm honestly going to have to say I really like YouTube so much better because I have my own channel. Uh, phone or text? Honestly, text. Easier, quicker. Book or movie? You know, I'm a movie buff and I'll go to a theater no matter what. So definitely the movies and I've already seen three movies in the last month. Comedy or horror? Definitely comedy. I stay away from the horror pictures. Coffee or tea? I am definitely a coffee person. Once a cup, one cup in the morning is all I need. Ooh, sweet or salty? Oh, that's a hard one. Mmm. I'm gonna have to go salty. I like the crunch. Oh, passenger or driver? Definitely a driver. I cannot handle people. Uh, I can't handle other people driving 
when I don't have that much control. So I'm definitely a driver. Winter or summer, definitely a summer. I love the sun. I love being outside. I do not like the cold. Ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da.